Hello! Today we're going to learn about algebra word problem. Let's say we have a problem like Maggie bought four pairs of socks and three shirts for two Y dollars. Each shirt costs fifteen dollars. A. Find the cost of each pair of socks. B. Find the value of Y if each pair of socks costs twenty-four dollars and each shirt costs six dollars less than socks. Now it says in the problem that she bought four pairs of socks. So that means that the cost of a sock, C for cost, S for sock, is equal to A dollars. And we know that she bought four pairs of socks. So the cost of four pairs of socks is equal to four A dollars. Now we know that she bought three shirts and each shirt cost fifteen dollars. So the cost, C for cost, S H for shirt equals to fifteen dollars. And she bought three shirts. So the cost of three shirts is equal to fifteen dollars times three which is equal to forty five. Forty five dollars. Now we know that she bought four pairs of socks and three shirts for two Y dollars. So let's write down. So four A dollars, which is the cost of four pairs of socks, plus forty five dollars, which is the cost of three shirts, is equal to two Y dollars. Now, it says to find the cost of each pair of socks. And a socks is, and one pair of socks is equal to A. So four pairs of socks is equal to 4A. So, we can simplify this equation. We can subtract 45 from both sides. 40 minus 45 minus 45. So we're left with 4a is equal to 2y dollars minus 45 dollars. And this is the cost of four pairs of socks. Now we're supposed to find what each pair of socks is, which is one pair of socks. So we could divide each side with four. So divide by four, and divide by four. So we're left with 4a divided by 4 is equal to a, which is equal to 2y minus 45 divided by 4 is 2y minus 45 over 4. So answer a is 2y minus 45 divided by 4. So Choice A, 2y minus 45 divided by 4. Now let's go to question B. B says, find the value of y if each pair of socks cost $24 and each shirt costs $6 less than socks. Now, we know that the cost of the socks is $24. So, C for cost, S for socks, is equal to $24. And we know that Maggie bought four pairs of socks. So, the cost of four pairs of socks is equal to $24 times four which is equal to ninety-six dollars.
Now, we know that a shirt costs $6 less than socks. So, the cost of a shirt, C for cost, SH for shirt, is equal to $24 minus 6, which is equal to $18. And we know that Maggie bought three shirts. So, so the cost of three shirts is equal to $18 times three, which is equal to $54. Now we know that Maggie bought four pairs of socks and three shirts for two wide dollars. So that means that she bought four pairs of socks, which is ninety-six dollars dollars. Ninety-six dollars plus three shirts, which is fifty-four dollars. And that is equal to the total cost, which is two. Why? Now, that means that 96 plus 54 is equal to 150, which is equal to 2Y. And this is the cost of 2Y dollars. And we're supposed to find the value of Y. So let's divide each side with 2. 2y divided by 2 is equal to y, and 150 divided by 2 is equal to $75. So we found the answer to problem B. Let's write that down. Question B is set y equals $75. Now, Maggie bought four pairs of socks and three shirts for two y dollars. Each shirt costs fifteen dollars. The cost of each pair of socks is two y minus forty-five divided by four dollars. And the value of Y, if each pair of socks is $24 and each shirt is $6, is Y equals $75. Today we learned about algebra word problem. Thank you for watching this video.